Welcome to Afraschooling. Wits University opened their system to accept applications for 2025 and in this video, you will learn how to apply for Wits University application. Before we go into the process proper, ensure that you have your identity documents and supporting documents ready. Also, if you have questions, you are free to drop them in the comments section. To apply for Wits University, you have to visit www.wits.ac.ca slash applications. In the situation where this link does not work, simply go to www.wits.ac.ca, on the menu click study with us, then scroll down to where you see apply online and click on it. It will take you to the application system. You don't want to miss out on opportunities for admission, subscribe now for updates on videos like this. Moving on, there on the application page, since you are just applying for the first time, click to create your temporary ID. Enter your country, enter your ID number, click the next field and some of your information will be entered automatically based on the provided ID. Fill in the rest of your information such as your first name, last name, email address, etc. When you get to this point, you will have to enter the symbols, this is for security reasons. Submit this information, click OK to receive your temporary ID and password. While your temporary password will be changed, your temporary ID may only be changed later. After clicking for an email to be sent to you, you will receive an email containing a link, your temporary ID and temporary password. Open the email, scroll towards the end of the mail, copy the temporary ID just towards the end of the document, then scroll a bit upwards to click the link. After the links page opens, enter your email as registered in the form you completed, paste your temporary ID in its respective field, go back to the email to copy your temporary password as well. Paste your temporary password in the respective field and click to continue. You now have to change the temporary password by entering your password on the first box and re-entering your entered password on the second box for confirmation after which you will click to continue. Please take note of your email address, temporary ID and especially your just created password. At this point, you will return to the login page where you will log in with your temporary ID and password. Inasmuch as completing your application is easier on a desktop device, you can still successfully complete your application on your mobile phone. Once you are logged in, select New Application, select the application type whether it's an undergraduate or postgraduate, select Academic Year, obviously 2025, and select Academic Calendar, the only option is January. Click Continue. If the next page doesn't load in less than one minute then you have to log out and log in again. Simply click Exit, and then click the three dots on the menu and click Log Out. Load wits.ac.ca slash applications again and log in with your information. This time you will select continue with application. Tick the application that shows up and click continue. Now here is where the application is done proper. Take note of these instructions, dedicate 30 minutes to complete your application, but in essence you have until the closing date to complete your application. After completing any section, click validate to check for errors, and after it is confirmed to you that there are no errors, you can click save and click continue to move to the next section. Every section must be completed and necessary documents must be uploaded. When it comes to selection I believe you must have gotten advice on the subject combinations for your desired program. Ensure you fill them in accordingly because the system may not submit if there are any errors. Please ensure you take your time to go through your application. If you need to, watch this video again and if you have any question whatsoever as it relates to WITS application, let us know in the comments. Afraschooling wishes you success in your academic journey. Peace.